Welcome to another edition of A New Me, your weekly consultation with the Washington, D.C. area's best doctors and professionals. Our guest experts help you learn about the latest medical advances and procedures by providing you with the real information necessary to help you eliminate the dangers of making the wrong medical and cosmetic enhancement decisions. Get ready for your consultation. Coming up, we will be on location at Starbright Dental in Rockville, Maryland, discussing how you can get the beautiful and healthy smile that you've always desired through the latest advances in dentistry with one of this area's top dentists, Dr. Miriam Safi. Dr. Safi received her Doctor of Dental Surgery degree from the University of Maryland. She is a member of the American Academy of Cosmetic Dentistry, among others. Welcome, Dr. Safi. Oh, thank you. It's our pleasure to have you. Your first time, I believe, on A New Me. Yes, it is. Well, we've got a lot to talk about, and I understand there's going to be a patient joining us shortly. We're also going to see a procedure, not to mention patient before and after pictures. So let me just begin right off the bat, if I may, by asking you to please tell us about these significant advances which have taken place in dentistry over the last few years. Yes, um, there's been a lot. There's been a lot of, actually, um, advances, which... Let me start with one of the procedures that I actually do the most, which is called um, veneers. Um, I do what's called the lumineers, and uh, right now they are one of the nicest, actually the most advanced uh, type of veneers that are around. And one the, of, this is a cosmetic procedure? Yes, it is. And what, does vene what do veneers do, actually, doctor, for those of us who may not know? Oh, that's a very good question. Basically, veneers are just a thin porcelain it's like a shell that goes on top of a patient's tooth. So it can correct many, many um, uh, abnormalities with the teeth. Like if a patient wants to immediately uh, correct their, the way their teeth come together, or they want to close the spaces, or they've been unhappy with just the shape of their teeth or their life, um, lumineers basically are just a two visits. There is no anesthesia involved. So basically you're looking at obviously a treatment option here. Mm -hmm that you just mentioned that yeah. corrects uh, crooked teeth, broken teeth, misaligned teeth. In other words, it can give us that look and feel that we used to have exactly. or that we may have never had exactly. to achieve that beautiful smile. Exactly. And I mean, the, one of the most important part of it, because veneers have been around for many, many years, okay. the, one of the biggest advances is that this is a very thin, and in many cases, we hardly have to touch a tooth to be able to put this on because it has, the technology has made it so thin that we don't have to really mess with the natural the structure of the tooth. So it's got a very natural look and feel to yes. it as opposed to a few years back. Yes. And that would be one of the major advances within that treatment option. It is, absolutely, absolutely. Well, what about some other treatment options as well? Well, one of the really, the biggest technology in my life of dentistry is using laser in dentistry. I mean, I have been able to do procedures that 20 years ago, um, when I was out of dental school, it was just very, it was harder for the patient and it would take so much longer. But laser and soft tissue laser dentistry, I can't even tell you the differences make in changing a person's smile and actually like if there is too much gum or you know the patient has areas that the gum doesn't look good, it has been absolutely amazing. Now, I wanted to ask you, Dr. Safi, the laser treatment option that you just mentioned, is that also more cosmetic focused, or if you can please elaborate on that for us so we get a better understanding of it? Um, no, it actually, laser can be used in many different areas of dentistry, but particularly when it comes to cosmetic dentistry, I basically do use it, like if uh, the patient has a different gum line in different area of a tooth, like makes the tooth look smaller just because the gum is longer on that area, Laser surgery is a very non-invasive. I mean, as far as the discomfort level, it's not even a day of healing. And um, that's been one of the, really one of the tools that I use a lot in creating that perfect smile in combination with other procedures. Well, that's certainly very interesting, doctor. Mm -hmm. And if you could please tell us some of the problems that these treatment options would correct. I mean, obviously we understand that it, the, they both help us certainly get that better smile, that healthier smile, but any dental problems that they correct as well? Yeah, I mean, if especially like with veneers, if a patient has cracks or if he has, like, you know, the patient has 
um, cavities on the teeth. And a lot of times patients use what's called bonding, which is just a, a tooth color filling, which unfortunately it stains over time and it changes color. But the veneer, we can actually cover it up. So, um, and right now, one of the studies that's been ongoing with the veneers, especially lumineers, it has shown over 20 years that these veneers keep their color, um, their integrity, and they stay in the patient's mouth. Talk about a long-lasting yeah. result, my yeah. goodness. Yeah. Now, how are these procedures typically performed, uh, just so we have an idea of what we're looking at? I mean, is right. there, do these take a few hours? Do they take, you know, do you have to come back for multiple visits? Just so, if you right. could please elaborate for sure. us. Sure. Basically, if I, don't, if I don't need to do laser surgery on a patient, lumineers are the two-visit service. So the patient comes in, we'll do the models, the molds, the impressions of the teeth. And um, the patient will come back usually within two to three weeks. And that's the day we spend about an hour and a half to two hours. And once we're all satisfied with the veneers, the patient actually goes home with the veneers on their teeth. Basically, they can literally come in during their lunchtime yeah. and leave with a beautiful smile. Yeah, it is a two-visit procedure. That's certainly very interesting. Yes. Now, you touched on a few moments ago, Dr. Safi, that for instance, on the porcelain veneers, the results can last up to 20 years. Right. Uh, can you please give us an idea of, of some of the other treatment options, like the laser dentistry, for instance, that you touched on earlier as well, right. and what type of results we're looking at from that? Uh, those were actually lifetime. I mean, they whatever we do with the uh, laser, it's we change the shape of the gums. Um, in many cases, like I said, because the healing is so fast, and the laser is basically virtually heals as it does the procedure. It's one of the incredible technologies in dentistry. So, yeah, the dead result does last. Dr. Safi, I believe you have some patient before and after pics that you'd like to show us? Yes, I do. Let's take a look. Great. So here we have Rebecca. Uh, she basically was born with discolored teeth, and all, all her life she's had this uh, gray, which has like purplish color, which it has really made it very difficult for her as far as, you know, smiling in her social life. So what we did for her, she got 10 veneers, lumineers, and um, this is where you see her before and after. Next we have uh, Maggie. Uh, now Maggie has had these different color, you know, caps that are called crown or caps that have been put in. So you see all the different coloration in her mouth. And she really basically came to me saying, I want to smile again. And this is what we did her after. Some very impressive results, Dr. Safi, and a very natural look and feel from what we just saw in those after pictures. Thank you. Now, who would be a typical candidate, doctor, for some of these treatment options? I mean, we went over some uh, very drastic changes, but really, anyone that is unhappy with their smile and they want to change anything in their smile. Like they have a picture in their head that this is how their smile, they always want it to be. Really with the procedures we have, you know, with veneers, the laser, even Invisalign, which is an invisible braces, the patient can get their smile they always wanted. We're now gonna meet one of Dr. Safi's patients. Welcome, Rebecca. Thank you, it's great to be here. Oh, it's our pleasure to have you on as well and we always appreciate it when patients take the time in their busy lives to come down and share their experiences for a few moments with us. Absolutely. I wanted to begin by asking you if you could please tell us what dental problems were you experiencing that made you decide to come and see Dr. Safi? Well, my whole life I'd have problems with tricycline staining on the top of my teeth and it looks like a bluish gray stain and I've always been embarrassed about it. Oh, so this is something you've had, I take it, from what you just mentioned for quite some time, since you were very little? Yeah, after when your per my permanent teeth grew in, okay. um, it was noticeable. So I've had it my whole entire life, basically. And what are you going to have done here with Dr. Safi? Well, we're looking to do lumineers, and um, we, we got 10 lumineers to cover the top of the teeth. And we also did laser, gum lasered. And how many visits do you foresee to, uh, that are going to be needed to have this taken care of? Actually, this is going to be my last one. Okay. I've already had two. The first process was um, taking the molds, having the gums lasered, um, and then also they prepared the teeth where they 
um, I guess do a little bit of scratching. I don't know the technical term for it. And it makes, um, when they prepare the teeth to put the lumineer on, that the cement will actually stick to the surface. Oh, that's certainly good to know. <laughs> and that way it stays on there very solidly. Yes. And it certainly seems like you're already very pleased and happy and rather excited, aren't you? I am. I'm very excited. This is going to be a, a life transformation. And um, to be able to smile and not be self-conscious is an amazing thing. So I look, I'm, I'm very excited. I look very much forward to it. Well, we certainly wish you all the very best, Rebecca. And on that note, I'd like to thank you for joining us on A New Me. Thank you. Thank you for having me. We're now back with Dr. Safi. I must say, Rebecca seems very, very excited about having this done. Yes, yes. I mean, it's also very exciting for us to be able to change somebody's life. So, yes. Well, the feeling you must get, doctor, from, like you said just now, changing one's life, bringing that confidence back in so many people with some of these treatment options, uh, it must be a great feeling indeed. It sure is. It sure is. Dr. Safi, we've only got a few moments left, and I wanted to ask you, before I let you go, your practice and yourself, certainly Starbright Dental, have developed a very strong reputation within the field of dentistry for this region, and I wanted to ask you, what makes you so unique? Uh, well, I do have an incredible team with me. I mean, if you ask many of my patients, I do have an incredible staff. I mean, every single one of them are very professional, and they really care. Uh, about every single patient. Um, the other thing is I've been doing this for so many years and cosmetic dentistry has been my passion even from the beginning when I was in dental school. So that is what the result, the patient come to me and that's what I give them. So it's a very personalized approach with a dedicated and caring staff. Amazingly, yes. I'd be very proud of it. Well, that's certainly good to know. And on that note, Dr. Safi, I would like to thank you for joining us and being a guest on A New Me. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it.